Hi, so in this video I want to talk about um, an interesting channel which has popped up on my YouTube uh, news feed and it's called um, Vision Specialists of Michigan um, and the video that popped up on my news feed is called, here we are, it's called is it my eyes? Uh, Dr. Rosner explains binocular vision. So um, this is the channel for obviously an eyewear company that specialises in uh, binocular vision and their angle is that even a small amount of misalignment can cause problems. Um, so I mean, the, the channel has um, some explanations of the symptoms, the problems it can cause, how they can help. Um, they've also got personal testimonials. Um, and what they seem to do is um, normally if you have um, a problem with binocular vision and you get uh, prescribed prisms, you, you need to have... Um, quite a bit or quite an obvious problem to get taken seriously. Um, so they kind of go for the smaller amounts on the basis that this can cause just as much of a problem as, um, you know, very obvious large amounts. Um, and one of the things is that you know, for some people, mis misaligned eyes, um, you know, you can see an obvious uh, strabismus, but a lot of people's eyes can look perfectly normal and they've still got a problem. And what I do like is that um, they, they explain that, I mean, in the, in the title, Is It My Eyes?, um, that this can present itself initially as completely different things. Um, so it could come over as anxiety or nausea or dizziness, um, you know, which would lead people to think, oh, it's a stress problem or it's a balance problem or it's an ear problem. Um, so I, I do like that approach because a lot of what goes on with the eyes um, you really need a whole body approach and it may not be obvious for quite a while that there is a problem actually with the eyes and if you correct that you correct all of the other problems um, so they've they've got a website um, called is it my eyes and you can do a questionnaire um, about your symptoms and I, I think it's well worth doing. I did the questionnaire. Um, now I am much much better um, since the hyperopia has been corrected. Um, so I had kind of fairly low scores on all of the things and I got back a score of 39 and um, in their literature a score of 15 or above can indicate that you, you have the, these problems. Um, so, I mean, it would seem to be setting the bar a little bit low, but um, it does actually make sense that they're casting the net very wide um, so that they can exclude people um, maybe after an investigation, but the fact that they're drawing in um, people who would, you know, who might not um, be taken seriously otherwise, I think is actually a good thing. Um, so, uh, yeah, they they do say they follow this up with a phone call. Um, so that would actually be quite quite interesting. Um, you know, I'd very much like to have this um, discussion. Um, now, the the only caveat I do.
do have is that um, of obviously they're selling a product. Um, it, it looks like a very good product actually, but obviously this is to be to be borne in mind. Um, and also, uh, yeah, I've lost my thread. Um, but also, they, yeah, that was it. They, they are approaching this from one particular angle. And I don't know how much um, they would look at other eye conditions, other things that, you know, are going on with this. Because this is something I've... I've noticed um, in the optical world, if everyone has their own angle that um, they're promoting. And the problem with that is, yes, someone may have a problem with their binocular vision, or someone may have a problem with hyperopia, or someone may have a problem with dry eyes. Um, but you must treat everything which, which is present and okay they're, they're treating this one thing probably because they're specializing um, in this one thing and I think that does tend to be a bit of a US thing um, what I think really really needs to happen is that all these specialisms are more joined up with each other so that you know a patient who has m more than one problem which most people are going to have it means they can move easily between one um, specialist and the next and they can you know kind of share notes so that they get a continuation of the right treatment um, so I would definitely like to see more of that because I think that is really important but I really do like the look of this um, channel and I would definitely like to see um, how it develops so yeah please do go and have a look at um, this YouTube channel um, and the, the website is it my eyes uh, so is it eye specialists of Michigan um, yeah and please like and subscribe and hope to see you in my next video